five, four, three, two, one. Right now, I am the Senior Vice President for Medical Affairs, this uh, company, Fortune Care Inc., and also the Medical Director. I am fortunate to be one of the founding members of this Epsilon Sigma Fraternity Sorority. Uh, I am one of the 12. Uh, I encourage you to join this uh, group, this sorority fraternity. Magiging masaya kayo dito. Magkakaroon kayo ng brother, sister, kuya, father. So marami. Diversified ang personality. Uh, diversified ang skills. And we assure you, para kang naka-insure dito sa, sa, sa fraternity, sa community nito. You are insured that once you join this, hindi ka iiwanan ng grupo ng hanggat hindi ka maging doktor or hanggat hindi ka maging successful sa inyong Joseph Gabriel. Stella, ang hirap maging doktor, ang hirap mag-aral ng doktor. So, you need to survive. So, anong gagawin mo for the survival? Eh di, sumali ka. Sumali ka sa isang grupo na sa tingin mo, may gagabay sa iyong pag-aaral. At sa pagpili ng grupo, ay eh, tingnan mo yung background profile. Ano siya ng Sigma Rho? Pag i-compare ko sa iba, ito ba yung ginawa lang ng mga lasingkero dyan sa labas para may bubugbugit pag may kaaway? No. Ginawa ito ng mga professional na tao para tumulong sa maging doktor para magabayan din ang karit. At pagdating ng araw, pwede rin tumulong para sa mga estudyante. So, kung ako ang estudyante ngayon, sasali ako sa fraternity. Kahit sa ang sektor ng lipunan. And, there is a constant connection pa rin. Kaya pag isang tawag lang, sabihin mo lang na Opsilon Sigma Rho ka. Pag sinabi mo na Opsilon Sigma Rho brand na yun, it's a good uh, fraternity existing in MCU. And all the members are successful doctors, respectful in their own profession. Hindi man nakadoktor yung iba, successful pa rin siya. I'm Dr. Roland De Los Reyes. Uh, presently, I'm a, an active cardiologist here at St. Louis Medical Center. Yeson City. I'm a member of USR since 1983. I'm the batch leader of the Gamma Batch and later on Chancellor in 1986. We established USR in MCU because we felt there was a need to have an organization that would help us pass the challenges of a medical student. It was very difficult then because of our perseverance, because we believe in each other, because of the camaraderie 
the brotherhood and the sisterhood, we were able to, to surpass all the challenges of that first year. And we were able to pass on our legacy to the subsequent batches. I'm very proud that after 32 years, USR is still very much alive, become a very big family. It has grown not only into a medical organization, a confraternity, if others would call it, but it has become a big USR family. Medical school days, we have already achieved our initial goals. And presently, USR has been listed in the SEC, Security and Exchange Commission. And the more USR has become active and supportive of all the members. Right now, USR has been lending support no? not only to the medical students because yep, USR brothers and sisters, no? successful doctors all over the nation and even abroad. The decision to join an organization MCU is a very big decision and I can proudly say that if you decide to join USR, then it will be a decision that that you'll always be proud of. It will be a very big uh, life changer if you decide to join USR. Uh, I think you have to make your decision now. namin dito sa Tagig Social Hygiene Clinic ng Tagig Pateros District Hospital. Nag uh, aalaga ko ng mga kalusugan ng ating mga taga-tagig in terms of pag-control po ng HIV at mga sexually transmitted infection. Uh, sa tulong po ng aking mga staff with respect to infection, at nagbibigay din po kami ng libreng screening. Bakit ako sumali sa USR? Before, gusto ko lang ng adventure. Gusto ko lang ng bagong friends. Gusto kong maging in. Pero nung nandun na ako, nakita ko yung brotherhood at sisterhood. So, ngayon, andyan dyan silang lahat. Everywhere, may USR. Kahit sa ang ang hospital, malaman lang nila na USR ka, meron ng lalapit sa'yo, may tutulong sa'yo, at may kakamay sa'yo, at makikita mo na hindi ka nag-iisa. Nakita ko kung paano nila ako tinulungan para makatapos ng med, paano ka nila i-encourage. Nakita ko kung paano ko nagamit ang natutunan ko sa Upsilon Sigma ro para tapusin ko ang medicine at makapasa ng board exam. So, kung kayo ay magde-decide, ang piliin po ninyo ay USR. Uh, I'm Dr. Rosaldo Ines Vaz, uh, fellow in thoracic and sociology here at the Lung Center of the Philippines. Uh, currently, I'm the chief fellow of the department. Uh, previously, I graduated uh, General Asia at the Ng Maynila Medical Center, also the Chief Resident uh, during my time. Uh, currently, my hospital affiliation is here in the Lung Center of the Philippines and Hospital Ng Maynila Medical Center. Ang deciding factor is yung parang lupso ng dugo, iba kapag mayroong kang pamilya, iba yung dating, whether or not uh, uh, may kanya-kanyang pag-ihikaya ng mga yung grupo. Malalaman mo ka agad yun. So, go with your instinct. Go with your lukso. So, uh, regarding kung regarding kung yung tanong ng iba na, mamimaintain ba namin yung grades namin even when you do the 
the, the process of uh, uh, applying. Uh, ako kasi, I, from first year, second year, third year, uh, din sister din ako, from first year, second year, third year. And uh, yung USR taught me how to manage things, especially uh, how to prioritize. So, uh, yung training ng USR itself, and even becoming part of the, the, the family, will actually not make you just a good student. Not, will not just make you a good doctor or, or uh, even a resident or a fellow, but uh, will actually make you a better person. So, that's the main that lesson that I got from being a, uh, being a member of the US. I'm Reverend Nesmanaulis. Hello. Mabalik kami from Alfred. Currently, we're having our senior internship here at Quezon City General Hospital. Chan Angela Mendoza, uh, first year surgery resident. USR, Batch Alpha Lambda. Chancellor, 2009 2000. Batch leader, Alpha Lambda. I'm Soxie Martin. I'm from Alpha Gamma Batch. I'm a former Chancellor of the Upsilon Sigma Rho Conference. So, bakit ako sumali ng USR? Unang-una, nung freshman ako, actually, hindi ko talaga gustong sumali. Wala ako sa mararalong plan na pagsali. Kahit yung kuya ko, si Carolino, eh, member na siya ng USR. What changed my mind? Nung acquaintance party ng medicine, home medicine, nakita ko yung batch ng alpha mo na nag-intermission number and sumasayaw sila. Kasi sobrang sabog lang nung sayo nila. Sobrang naramdaman ko yung saya nila na kahit hindi ganun kaganda yung sayo nila, pero nag enjoy sila na magkakasama. Yun. That changed my mind. Kaya ako sumali. Parang gusto ko ma-feel yung saya nila na magkakasama sila, yung bonding nila. So, na para talaga silang isang family. Ako, bakit ako sumali ng USR? Uh, siguro noong una kasi yung kuya ko, uh, member na din ng USR. Pero, kasi minsan gumibisita yung mga batchmate niya sa bahay, nakikita ko yung bonding nila na magpa-batchmate. And then, sobrang close sila. Tsaka, parang na din sila magkakapatid. And then, no ano, nag-tinry ko din mag-quit. Pero, nagpatuloy ako kasi nakita ko yung mga, uh, yung mga seniors, parang sila pa yung nag-encourage sa amin na, Uy, kaya nyo yan, kaya nyo matatapos nyo din yan. Kaya, sobrang saya ng uh, USR kasi wala, parang talaga yung sabong pamilya yung treatment nila sa isa't isa. Brothers and sisters na talaga yung trato nila sa iyo. Kaya ako sumali ng USR. In the fraternity, primarily because um, I wanted to spend my time with my friends. Um, but once um, the initiation, um, it began to grow on me. That the fraternity grew, grew on me and uh, I learned to love it so much. And um, it remained one of the most important things in my life. Unity, self-reliance, and respect. Encouraging all of you to join our confraternity because um, all of my all of my swag and all of my confidence I gained from this confraternity.